businesses are driven by, you know, what problem are you trying to solve? But it sounds like you kind of had a front row seat in observing the problem. And, but you had to get savvy in technology because you don't have a technology background. So how did that all evolve? Right. Yes. So I'm a non-technical founder, which means I really don't know anything about technology, right? I don't code, don't develop all that stuff. So that was definitely one of the biggest learning curves because coming from kind of restaurant retail background, I felt like I could almost do anything, right? I can make a business plan. I can deal with financials, hiring, marketing, customer service, right? But then how do I make technology? How do I make a platform? So that required a lot of research, right? And kind of tapping into local resources, but then also the internet, YouTube University, all that good stuff. And we were lucky enough in our kind of startup journey to meet partners that were local to us in Arlington, Virginia, in an accelerator program hosted by Unstuck Labs. And they became kind of our technical partners and mentors and advisors. And they were able to do right all the technical work, but then also teach us to do the technical work. Because long term, I have had to learn, you know, what all these words mean, or how do I develop a product, or how do I even hire for a technical role within my company. And having partners that kind of taught us everything along the way with the Unstuck Labs team has been super crucial to continuing our growth, right, and, and growing the right way, I think. 